Hi quilters, I've been saving up some fabric boxes so we could do a fun unboxing. So let's see what's new at the Quilted Forest. Ooh, that was heavy. For the first box, we have fabric from Wyndham. This one is called Free Range. This looks like just a background. It's just a little bit of a pattern to it. And this one, Looks like it's a patriotic line. And here's the red that goes with it. Here is, look at this fun star fabric. It's got all the colors, the dark blue, lighter blues, red, all on a white background. Next one out of the gate is the same as the white and the red, but in blue. That's a really pretty fabric. This is gonna be a great addition to our red, white, and blue. Ooh, I like this one. This one has words on it. Uh, made in the USA, America, freedom, land of the free, pride and honor, USA. That's awesome. I love the color on that too. And the last one in this box is a dark blue with white stars. Perfect, love that. All right, box one done. Box two, oh, more of that. That is fun, look at that. It's kind of the, like a bunting. That's really cute. Loving that. All right, so now also we have the word fabric again, but with a dark blue background has those same words, dark blue background instead of white. And down here on the bottom, it looks like we have a panel. Oh, this is the one I've been waiting for. It's the flag at the top, it says home of the brave. And the bottom, it's got this vehicle with the flag on it. And a couple of roosters. It's fun little farm country kind of flag fabric. Also in this box, we have a couple of prints that are speckles. This is from a grouping called Catsville, but I think I just got these two pieces because I liked them because they were speckled. I just thought that was a really neat look. So we've got the black background and a white background. Here we go with box number three. This one's from Moda, and, ooh, pretty. Oh, this is very pretty and springy. All right, this is a line called Wild Blossoms. So you can see the little bee in there. These sweet little bees. And then this one is a tone on tone with green. And then we have the same in blue. It's kind of a, maybe a little bit purpley. And then we have this adorable little multicolor floral. Again, there's some little bees in there, but it's got pink and orange and purple and blue. Very delicate and pretty. And then there's a like a mason jar kind of look, different flowers on it. So we've had a couple florals, a couple planes, and then this one is a big floral. It's got these giant bees on there. Big, bold, beautiful print. And that is called Wild Blossoms. That's by Robin Pickens. 
Box three done. Box number four. Here are the pre-cuts that go with the Wild Blossoms fabric. We have mini charms. We have charms. Got a bunch of those. And then I also got layer cakes. So lots of fun new pre-cuts to go with that line of fabric. Here we are on box number five. This one is called Delivered with Love. And this, we got pre-cuts of charm packs and of mini charms. And I think this is just a little cute little baby line. I'm gonna open one of these quick. Kind of give you a little run through so you can see what the colors are. Oh, really sweet. Oh, those are so cute. Oh, I've been looking for a fun new little baby line. Oh, that's adorable. All right, so that was in box number five. Let's see what box number six has in it. Oops. Oh, good, it's the pieces that go with this. So we have the pre-cuts and now here's some yardage. Now this one is a panel and I think it's to help with moms that want to have pictures of their little ones and says how many days, weeks, months, years on it. There's a big elephant. Put it by the baby to take a picture. So that's a fun new little panel we have. And then we have some prints to go with it. Look at those adorable little elephants. Oh my gosh, those are so stinking adorable. And then to go with it, we have a stripe. And then the soft little gray. It's kind of like a background. But really soft. And then there's white stars on there. And then this gray has these little dots kind of in the cornerstones. And then the last bolt of this is the stars, but multicolor stars on white. Oh, so stinking cute. Next, I'm going to open this one. This one is on a tube, so it's, well, I don't want to use a knife on it because I don't want to cut into it by accident. But I wanted to get some of this cork. Look how shiny that is. That is really fun. Now this is cork and it's got a, a fabric back. It's really soft, very pliable. Be great for bags. Um, all sorts of fun stuff you could make with this. And we will probably pre-cut sections so you can just buy small chunks of it. Boy, that is fun. I love this kind of stuff. Let's see what's in here. I've been trying to fill some holes on the wall. So I've got some basics coming in. This is my box of fun stuff. I've got some black and white fabrics. I noticed we were low and had somebody in wanting to see some, so I decided I better plump up the selection. So nice black and white prints. Here is a red fabric. I noticed red, white, and blue was getting a little low. So here's a really nice red. That's got a nice design to it. I got this design in both red and navy. 
almost looks like denim. It's a really nice little fabric. Uh, here's another black and white. It's kind of a fun little stripey look. And this is the same as the blue and the red, but in kind of a graphite color. And another black and white. That's white with a little black, almost like an asterisk on it. And then I found this cute little 30s print. I thought that was really sweet. I didn't have a lot of background with a figure on it in the 30s, so that good one to throw in there. And I got a new little Harry Potter print. And this one just has some of the Harry Potter symbols on there, little little broom and the Triwizard Tournament cup. Lots of fun little stuff on there. I'll do something fun with that. Box number eight. Oh, this one's almost already kind of open. All right, what's in here? Oh, these are cute. Funny little farm animals. Oh my gosh. Look how silly they are. Oh, that is so cute. There's some barns, there's a llama, pig, cow, horse. Looks like a goat, sheep. And here is just sheep. You can get those and count them and put yourself to sleep at night. This one is kind of like an overall print. The animals are kind of spread out a little bit more. Be great for a border. And then it looks like I have some new books. This one is called Farmland Tales and features those fun little animals. Makes a cute book, although you could also cut these apart and use each of these little squares individually in a quilt. If you didn't want to make a book, look at the adorable selvage on this one. It's a bunch of tractors. Oh my gosh. Okay, now I gotta make one of these. All right, let's see. Got two more books in here. This one is called I Dig You, and it's got all sorts of like diggers and trucks and things like that out there. That'd be a fun little quilt. Also, you could just cut out the individual pieces. And if you don't wanna make a book, that's another way you can use these. This one is called, I Love You Even When You're Crabby. Next box. Let's see what's in this one. This one also contains just some great basics. Well, this one's gonna be hard to see unless I unwrap it. That one's just a nice little, it's like a little ginkgo leaf, but it's a tone on tone, nice black fabric. This is a gray with a little bit of a design. Nice little background fabric. It's another tone on tone print. You won't see unless I unwrap it. This is black with these little swirls in there. There's a nice royal blue. And then I've got the same print in this gray color. And I have the, another one of that same print, 
but in a white with just a little hint of a like an ecru on there and the last fabric out of that box is a nice little check and it's black and looks like black and white or black and cream but nice little addition to the black and white wall first line I'm going to show you is the is May, from Maywood Studio and this is the All Iowa Shop Hop fabric. Now we can't sell this fabric till June but I got some kits ahead of time so that I could make some samples. The first fabrics I'm going to show you are the are like the tone-on-tone uh, -on -tone prints that go with the line. So these are just um, prints that I got to coordinate with the fabric. I got the red, the light green, the cream, and then the blue. This one's shiny, it's gonna be hard to see. Just nice, nice colors. Nice usable fabrics. And then the prints that are specific for the All Iowa Shop Hop. This is the card, it has all the fabrics on it but I'm gonna unwrap this so you can see the different pieces. This is the panel, and this is like Iowa State Fair fabric. So the top just has an overall fair scene, and then in the bottom half is six different panels. So it has the livestock pavilion, horse barn, cattle barn, grandstand, the old mill and sheep barn. And then a little farm scene at the bottom. So these you can cut apart and use for a bunch of different things. So besides the panel, we have this dark blue print that has like little camping scenes. So for those people who like to camp near the fairgrounds, it's a great little piece for them. And then it has those same buildings, kind of an overall print with a few other things thrown in there like the giant slide and like a little bench and that kind of thing. And then there's a nice gorgeous little tree fabric. And then this print has cows and pigs and horses. Let's put it so you can see the right side up. This one has ducks and sheep and geese and cows. This has a red background and different kind of like barns and buildings, kind of more like a farm scene. And then this one is called Midway, it has all the rides and the circus sort of atmosphere kind of look to it. And then there are also, in red, white, and blue, fabrics that have words. So these words are like grandstand, giant slide, horse barn, butter cow, all those kinds of things. So this is the Iowa Shop Hop 2023 fabric. And also cute, adorable, um, selvage edge there and it also says all Iowa shop hop 2023 so that's the fabric for our all Iowa shop hop this year I'm really excited to work on something fun for a project I haven't decided what I'm going to make yet but you will see it soon
So the All Iowa Shop Hop will go for the months of June and July. And then in the middle of July, we also do a kind of little regional shop hop. And we call that the Party Express Shop Hop. And so every year, if you go to all of the shops, you buy a passport, you go to all the shops and make a purchase, you get your passport stamped. And then at the end, you get a bundle of fabric. This year's fabric, it's gonna be eight half yard cuts. And I have the fabrics right here. So they're very usable fabrics, kind of tone on tone kind of things. It's kind of like a shadow look here or um, modeled. And this one we have, this year we're gonna have purple. It's really pretty pink. Very nice green. Red. This is such a great yellow. That's a beautiful yellow. And then there's three different blues. So we have kind of a dark, not quite navy, but darker than royal, I think. And this one's kind of like a sky blue. And then finally, an aqua. And I think these are just super usable fabrics. This will be for our Party Express Shop Hop. So really excited. We're going to get these cut into half yard bundles and uh, figure out something fun to make with them. Hope you enjoyed seeing all the new fabric and uh, we'll have more coming soon. Thanks for watching and happy quilting.